Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'll be showing you how to, on uh, Windows 11, how to change the wallpaper. As you can see here guys, I have a very cool wallpaper that's set up. Now of course, this tutorial assumes you already have your wallpaper that you want to set as your desktop background already pre-prepared. Now there are multiple ways to go about this. I'm going to show you um, these um, several ways that you can go about um, implementing a wallpaper all right so the first thing you want to do guys is to go ahead and locate your wallpaper as you can see here guys I have a wallpaper here and I have several of these um, the, currently this one is set as the background um, you can simply go ahead and hover over the wallpaper you want to set then you're going to um, right click once you right click guys you're gonna look through the options on screen very carefully and of course you should see at the top here one that says set that's desktop background now once you click set desktop background the um, whatever wallpaper you have set will automatically be the background as you can see all right now of course sometimes if i just go ahead and set a background it will not be customized properly so i'm going to show you the second way that gives you full control that's just the quick shortcut all right so the perfect way to do this is to right click on a home space on the desktop you're gonna go to um, personalize once you're on the personalized screen you're gonna see the option here that says backgrounds and of course you can see over here personalize is selected this is a quick way to get here uh, you can also get to here through the start then settings menu all right so you're gonna go to backgrounds once you're on background guys you can see that's already selected if you were doing it from here originally, you'd have to browse. So let me just show you the secondary way. So you'd come in here, browse for the photo. Um, you look for your location that you have, for example, in pictures. Then you go over to wallpaper. Then you'd select a wallpaper. So say, for example, I say I choose this. You go ahead and hit choose. All right, we have this one already chosen. And I'll click choose picture. So once you hit choose picture, you'll notice that that's the one that's selected. You can always change your mind. You can come in and you can choose like my original here. And I can say choose picture. All right, so notice once I've said choose picture, that one is selected. And of course, you can customize the layout. So for example, if I look at the desktop now, you'll notice it's okay. But I could do something else such as I could stretch. Notice it's refreshing. And stretch would mean that the wallpaper is stretched. You might be able to see it, maybe not. I could also select um, center and I can come back. As you can see, it's stretched to the center, much larger. That will not work. Um, in my case, I'll choose fill. Um, of course, if I choose fill, I can go ahead and look. And of course, fill looks more accurate. All right. So we can go ahead and close this out once I'm satisfied. So once I close out, um, of course, that's what you do. And you'll see that the wallpaper is set. So that's the second way to actually set the wallpaper. The first method is quick, gives you a little control. The second method allows you to go in and you can stretch and fit the wallpaper until it's perfectly sized. Sometimes it's too wide, sometimes it's too narrow, depending on the resolution of the wallpaper. So it's a good idea to go in and set it to stretch fill or whatever is your preferred settings until your desktop is perfectly draped with the new wallpaper and as you can see guys this is perfect for me so i'm just going to leave it as is and that's how you change the background on windows 11 all right using the two methods all right guys if you have any questions please ask them below as always guys ricardo saying bye until next time bye